Hey guys, this is Sean off White from Wolfpack Plays. Oh, arr! We're picking back up in Breath of the Wild. I did a little bit of exploring on my on, on my own, so you can see here we are in Kakariko Village, and isn't it just gorgeous? Look at all these cool houses and the cool architecture and the waterfall. It's just beautiful. Oh, it's just wonderful. I love it so much. Now. Like I said, I did a little bit of exploring. We came out of Impa's hut here, and uh, I did do a quest where we had to find 10 Kukos, yeah. put them in there for some cash. And then on top of that, I went into this shop. Now in this shop is some armor. Now you can buy armor here. You can buy a Hylian tunic, Hylian hood, Hylian trousers, or you can buy stealth tights. Stealth chest guard and a stealth mask. Now, the durability on these is a little less than the Hylian armor. However, you get up stealth. So I think I'm probably going to go ahead with the Sheikah armor just because I've been running around with level 1 armor all this time. I can, I can do with a couple extra hits as long as I can sneak up on somebody. The sneaking part, being sneaky, being a sneaky snoo, that is my specialty. So we're going to jump in here. We'll talk to Claire. Everything here is part of the specially curated Clary Collection. Please take your time and look around. Uh, Clary Collection? Mm -hmm. The Clary Collection is a high-end collection curated by me, Clary. But of course. <laughs> I've personally selected each and every item in here using my flawless fashion sense. It's all highly recommended. Each item has its own unique features and abilities. So take a look. Do you need anything else? Uh, can I buy it? I think I just... Oh, okay. I just wa walk over and say, All right. And I think 2,500. This is 600. 700. 1,300. Plus... Oh, I have enough. Got plenty. So let's go ahead. Let's... Uh, I'll take it. I'll take it. Thanks, you made a great purchase. Really? Oh. Yeah, that's 700. I'll take that too. Yep, take that too. <laughs> and then headgear, which I didn't have before. So no matter what, my total amount of armor is going up. It's not as high as the p potentially could be. However, it is, one, gonna look awesome. And two. Haha, <laughs> that's so cool. One, it looks awesome, and two, my sneak is, like, super good. It's, like, super good. See, like, look at my little noise meter in the corner, right there, that little that little one. And imagine if we had this stuff on. Ooh, what is this? When did I get that? Climber's bandana? I don't remember having that. Yeah, but see how noisy I am? We'll just equip these. I don't remember getting that bandana. So we're just gonna hang on to this. It'll be all sneaky and stuff. Might as well equip a, uh, a different weapon too. Now, again, like I said, I did a little bit of exploring in this area. I found all the cuckoos around, and one thing that I talked to a guy about was the Great Fairy Fountain. And the Great Fairy Fountain should be up there around the corner. However, I do want to go ahead knock out this shrine just so that uh, we can have a warp point to get back here at any time. So, good deal. Oh, gosh, I haven't played this game in like three weeks. I miss it so much. What do you guys think? Part of me just wants to do this, uh, do the series as a live stream series on Twitch now that summer break has started. So that during summer break, I can stream this once or twice a week for you guys and have a different series on Wednesdays. Or do you guys want to keep this as a YouTube exclusive series? What do you think? Let me know in the comments. Drop on down into this trial. Alrighty. Wow, big open room. To you who set foot in the shrine, I am Teloneg. I share with you my knowledge that it may please Hylia. Teloneg's teaching. Teaching. So it's not a challenge. It's just a teaching. Okay. This is interesting. This is different. Ooh! Oh, what? Oh! Use a side hop to avoid enemy attacks. This will create an opening that you can use to strike back. Okay. Oh! Gotcha! So it's like a combat tutorial. Let's get out our sickle. Oh, it's been like. It's
it's been harnessed. Look, one arm's missing, and it can't leave that spot. So I'll just hop. Your vicious sickle is badly damaged. Oh, that's not good. Ooh, 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 ooh. Glory rocket. Oh, it broke. Crap! Do a backflip to avoid any attacks. Create an opening to strike back. Okay, okay, I can do that. But, uh, but first things first. I need a weapon. I need a weapon. Alright, avoid the attack. Really? Oh, crap. Okay, shield broke. I didn't know all my stuff was that much. Alright, so wait for the attack. How do I- I got a backflip. How do I backflip? That's a backflip. Oh, I gotta actually point, like, in a diagonal away. Boom, 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 boom. Let's go. So strong. You can repel an attack if you parry with your shield just at the right time. Strike back if you open it, you create. Parry at the right time to knock an enemy back. Perfect guard. Alright. Ow. Well, it doesn't do a lot of damage, so that's good. Ow. Okay, come on. You can do this. Thing. Okay. Is that not right? Did that not do it? Ow. Pain. Hurt. Ow. Come on, I'm hitting the button. Is there a, there's a delay of some kind? I need a perfect guard. I'm doing it! Is that not it? Perfect guard. Parry at the right time to knock an enemy back. Oh! I missed a step. Oh! Oh, I hit I hit the trigger. Damn. Then release into a motion charge attack. Catch your enemies in this motion and damage them. So I build and hold. There we go. Guardian sword. Oh, that's so cool! <coughs> a sword often wielded by guardian scouts. Its blue energy blade is a product of ancient technology. It's not very durable. Oh, that's cool. You've done well. Now learn these crucial skills. Now proceed. Okay, so I learned it. What do I get for learning it? Do I just get to... Oh, I get a chest. Maybe this isn't one where I get a... Hang on. Let's check out this new sword. Oh, that's so cool! Oh, that's cool. Oh, I love it. Oh, sweet! I get a chest and an orb. Sweet! Opal, I'll take that. We'll come up here. We'll see uh, this nice guy up here. Your triumph over the test of strength subverts the prophecy of ruin. From the ashes of Hyrule, a hero rises. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. And I got another shawl. Got another shawl to add to my collection. I'm just gonna put it right there. It's gonna boot me right in the eye. Right in the eye of my chest. Right there. I'm put it right there. Keep it safe. Spirit orb! A symbol of courage given to those who have overcome the challenges of a shrine. Sweet! May the goddess Hylia smile upon you. Oh. Bye bye. It's always so sad. It's like they're giving up their life force just for me. As you can see here, we actually have four spirit orbs. So what I'm going to do is hop along down to the little shrine down here to Hylia. Whee! 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 I didn't want to damage my stuff. Alright, so now we pray to this chick. You have you who have conquered the shrines and claimed the spirit orbs. In exchange for four spirit orbs, I will amplify your being. So tell me, what is it that you desire? Uh probably another heart container. Yep, I'll take another heart container. So sweet! You get another heart container. It's so pretty, it's so gold and rad, and it just looks lovely. You put that right up there, right in the corner, right over top of the 
where I am, right underneath the me. It's right underneath the me. You can't see him. Put it there. I've got five. All right, so I want five because usually most of the recipes that I make uh, cap out at giving me five parts, and I want to be able to yeah! maximize the effectiveness of those meals. Uh, from here on out, for the next, like, two or three, I'll probably get stamina orbs, just because I want to be able to climb stuff and get places and fly forever. And there's a lot that uses stamina that, you know, there's a lot aside from just get take advantage that stamina does. Ooh, it's so pretty. I like this sword. I like it a lot. Alright, so I guess we'll head up this way. And like I said, it sounded like from talking in the, vi in the village to that guy that the great fairy shrine was up here somewhere, up above Kakariko Village. So, run through this little grove here. And I think this is it. I see fairies. I see a big thing. I think this is it. I, th I think this is it. Fairy! This fairy will fly from your pouch and heal all your wounds the moment you lose your last heart. It's easily mistaken for a firefly at first, but it will glow brightly. No, come back, come back. No, 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 no! I want you! Don't go away. Balls! Hang on, there's another one over here. No, no, no! Dang on it! Alright. Guess we'll, uh, we'll check this out. Boy? Sweet boy, please listen to my story. Sure, why not? Oh, oh, it is a great fairy fountain. I am the great fairy Kotara. This place was once a beautiful spring. But as time passed, fewer and fewer travelers offered me rupees. As a result, my power abandoned me. Woman, say what? Give you my rupees. Come on. I'm nearly powerless now, so I beg your help. I need rupees to become whole again. All I need is 100. Seeing as I just spent 1800, I think I might be able to spare 100. We'll do it this one time. This one time. I am not a fellow that usually gives in to the, uh, the requests of a gold digger. But, in this case, we'll see what happens. We'll see what she has to offer. Once my power's been restored, I can do great things, boy. Really? Do it from your game. I, I here you go. Okay, take the hundred. Real. Jeez, oh, come on. Are you gonna take a hundred from me every time I come here? Ah, the power! It's overflowing. Okay. Hey, right, the fountain. Okay, so there it is. Oh gosh! Awkward. Oh gosh! Oh. Okay, um... Alrighty then. Oh. This is a giant woman. Okay. Okay. I'm not too comfortable with this. She's not wearing much. <laughs> oh, what a feeling. The first breath of fresh air after an eternity of decay. It's just so intoxicating. Thanks to you, I've returned to my former glory. As they say, one good deed deserves another. I can help you, boy. Allow me to enhance your clothing. It's at least I can do. But I will need the necessary materials. Mm. With the power available to me, I should be able to enhance your clothing a little bit. Hands away. Uh, okay. Uh, what are you going to... Oh, blue nightshade. Oh, seriously? I have a ton of that. Whoa, and it's gonna boost my stuff ah. like crazy. Enhance the stealth mask, yes. Mm. <sighs> it's like that it's like the noise at the beginning of a jackass movie. Stealth mask! One to four. Ah. Fantastic. Just a bit stronger now. Oh. You've heard about set bonuses, right? How a set of clothes. Uh how a set of clothes that have all been enhanced twice could have a bonus, but only if you wear the whole set. Not all sets have a bonus. Yes, please, by all means, enhance them all. Ah. Yep. Yep. Mm. Cool. After all of these are enhanced, <sighs> because they're a set, they're probably going to have some kind of special power. And had I bought the other set, 
from down in the village, I may be able to power them up to a higher level. However, I do not ah. think mm. that uh, they'd have a set bonus. Ah. So let's see. Let's see what we get. Okay, can you enhance them again? Oh, I need like some kind of craziness to enhance Aww. them again. Oh, you're ready? How unfortunate for me. See you later. <laughs> okay, so can I get in the water? I can get in the water, and it's deep. It's not waiting water. Okay, climb out of there, Link. Climb on out of there. Ah, oh, just listen to that music. Ocarina of Time flashbacks. It's the same great fairy music that I grew up with. And that's about all the time we have for this episode of Wolfpack Plays. We went through another trial, learned a new set of skills, and enhanced all our armor, got some new cool duds. So from here, I think we're going to head on to Hiento Village. That's where Impa said that we needed to go next. But before we go, I did want to show you this. Check this out. Look at this little guy. Isn't he cool? A student from school got me this as like a goodbye present, and uh, I got it hanging off my microphone, so I can uh, have it there and you know play the get Zelda, play Zelda with you guys and have fun and look at that and be like, oh, that's so cool. But anyways, let me know in the comments down below if you want this series to continue as it is, or do you want this to be a Twitch exclusive? Do you want us to be live streaming this and have a different series on Wednesdays? It will probably be The Last of Us, just so you know. That's the next game I've got queued up. So, let me know in the comments down below what you would like to see, and if you liked it, hit that like button and share it with your friends if you dig it. If you want to join our wolf pack, you are more than welcome. Just hit that subscribe button and you're in. And we will see you in the next episode of Wolfpack Plays. Oh, I